So guys, we've shown you our last three rooms and they've been pretty amazing. Okay, two of them have been absolute shit. Like, I haven't showed you guys our uh, Disney room yet. Okay, so we're about to show you probably the best room that we're gonna have on this trip. So come with me. I am currently at the door. It is a sliding door. It is locked by this little boy right here. There is a lock outside. And we're just gonna walk in. We got this right here. This is where all of our luggage is. You gotta leave your shoes here. Because we're about to walk into some complete nonsense. So, actually, I missed some of the nonsense already. So we're gonna go back. I just put on slippers so I can walk through the nonsense. But right here, we have a sliding door. So we're gonna slide this door open. And right here, we have a tatami room. We got some glass. This is some windows here. But we have a tatami mat floor room with a TV. So we can chill, eat our shit here. This is amazing. This is what you would find in a traditional Japanese home. We got our air AC up here. That's pretty cool. We got this bad boy over here. That opens up into the master bedroom. So this is one of the stars of this location. We got this big old rock in here. We got this rock bed on the ground, but then you walk over to your room and boom, master bedroom. Out here, you can see that there's like an outside. We look to the left, what is this? I know what this is, why is it not opening? Oh, we push. That's why we push. So this is the washroom for the master bedroom. We got our AC up here. We have a nice ass sink. Look at this. Look at this. Are you kidding me? This is our accommodations. We got a shower right here, but we're going to keep on walking now because out here is where the nonsense starts. We got a little rock bed here. What does this rock bed lead to? This is an outdoor bath. Like we have some views to the moonlight out here. This is all wooden and we have ourselves an outdoor bath. This thing is freaking huge. This could probably sit three people. I'm not gonna lie. This thing is huge. All right, we're going back. We're going back. We're going back into the room. We got this rainfall shower here, you know, because we fancy. If you guys didn't know already, we fancy. So we're back in the main room. We're heading over to the other side of this place. This is where the tatami room is. But you know what? There is a second floor. There is a second floor. So let's go upstairs. We are coming upstairs, all right? This place is amazing. We got two floors over here. We got a living room. Look at this artwork. Pretty cool. We've got that traditional ceiling over here. We got some traditional like shelves and whatnot. But look at this. We got a glass ceiling over the main bedroom. It is pretty sick. So let's just walk over this and not pretend like we're not scared. <laughs> but then we have a kitchen. So we have, you know, your basic like kettle, microwave, refrigerator. We have a sink. Uh, we have this right here. I'm pretty sure, yeah. So we actually have an element so we can cook our own food. We have some dishes. We have some whatnot. So that's pretty good. So if we want, we can cook our own food here right now, which is pretty nice. Let's see if this slides open. It does. So we have a view of outside. It's not great right now, just because the reflections inside and the nightness outside, but we can have a view outside. 
But yeah, here's our little tea. We got a microwave. We got a refrigerator. Like I said, we've got a little hot, uh, we got an element, so if we wanted to cook food, we could. Um, under here, we have some more um, things that we could use. There's like a rice cooker, there's other stuff, other utensils. Uh, this is just, you know, apparently <laughs> just for, uh, you know. Anyways, off to the side here. I think we actually have another washroom. Yeah, so we do. So here's another washroom upstairs. Your typical Japanese toilet. You've got your bidet and all that fun stuff. You got a sink. But apparently the one downstairs, you have a hot tub and a jacuzzi setting. Uh, but also we have the outdoor bath, which is really cool. But yeah, the storage is really, really cool. As Emma is showing right now. You can just put what... Look at this. What is this? Emma, what is this? What is this? I don't know what this is, but I love it, and I'm glad it's here. But I love our counter. But, like, our counter looks like recycled other, like, crates and stuff. It's really, really cool. We have the high ceilings, which is really nice. Two nights. Two nights. So this is the other bedroom, by the way. So this one is purely traditional. It's all tatami floors and it is futons. So if you were to sleep here, it would be full on futons. You got the AC up here. You have the high roofs. You have the sliding windows. Let's see what the view is over here. You're looking over into other houses. That's really cool. You can't really see it right now. But also, this view is really, really cool. So you have the glass window back into the entrance. Really, really nice. This place is amazing. This may be the best place that we stay the entire time that we are in Japan. Right now, it's my favorite. I am holding out because there is a place in Miyajima that we are staying that may live up to it but right now this is number one right now there's no way that this is not number one but miyajima may live up to it so we're holding up to miyajima but right now this is insane